Hello, this is Ami Diamond. In this episode, I'll show you a new feature that's called Collapsible Section. The idea is, as you can see here, that you can, instead of having a long page where you need to scroll, you can, each section, you can group it and then you can show it. In this case, it's, it's even nice as a Q&A uh, where there's a question and there's an answer. Uh, what it does, it acts like an accordion. It actually saves lots of real estate on the, on the web page, and um, yeah, in future maybe it will be possible also to have a tab instead of uh, this collapsible. So how do we do it? So we need to edit the page, and let's create a new section totally. Yeah, so I have one section with two columns. I'll have I'll add a text web part. Also here I'll add a text web part. Maybe I'll put a image. And and now um, what I need to do is to go to the edit section. And there's a toggle here where I can make this section available. I can decide if to show a divider. I can decide if if the expand icon will be on the right or the left, and if it's uh, expanded or collapsed. Uh, I could give it here a name. This is actually something that has changed. It wasn't. It was initially on on that menu. Now it's here. So I could call it um, Q1. I click X and publish, and now I see this uh, this section. Um, so actually, as you saw, I can set it and decide if I want it to be open or closed. So let's make it expanded, for instance. I'll republish it, and you see by default. You manage each section and you can define what to do. Additional feature is that actually you noticed it's possible to copy the link to this um, section. So what we can do is like a table of content. If I click right, I can copy the link. Now let's say I have lots of sections. So I'll multiply all that. Uh, let's take this one and copy it multi times. Okay, let's give this a new name. I'll give this a name ZZZ. I'll publish it and copy the link. What I want to do is to add the link from the top and actually um, it will bring me automatically to where I am. So on the top of the page, I will edit and I will add a new section. Let's say with two columns and I'll add a text web part and I will add a link to this uh, section let's call it link to zzz i'll press save and publish so let's refresh the page so i if i click here it brings me directly to the section i want so this is actually um, something cool that you can make a table of content and uh, you could use it also, also to save uh, real estate and also to um, a use case like let's say of a Q&A. So this is all I wanted to share. So thank you for watching and please uh, subscribe and see you in the next training. Goodbye.